Hello everyone and welcome back to the nerd stream of uh, XCOM Enemy Within. I'm the Lethal and yeah, things are not looking good for us right now. If you've watched the last couple of episodes, you've seen that we've had many, many panics. We've had an entire squad of soldiers die on a council mission and now we have a terror site in Montreal. I've been racking my brain trying to think of a way to salvage this and it's going to be very very difficult, if it's even possible. What I think we should do, I do not always agree with Dr. Shen. have a look at our research, such I really really want to do a seeker ore type see, because that'll let our guys go invisible and should help us in combat, but Maybe we should wait for experimental warfare to finish. What's eight days going to do for us? Eh? <laughs> Ugh. No. Despite its physical appearance, this machine doesn't seem to be made up of any organic components. Its surface has an unusual metallic composition that somehow interacts with the vapors it releases for concealment. All right, so we've changed to the secret autopsy because. We need to do something drastic to get something good happening. All right, let's jump right into it and see how we go with this terror attack with a bunch of rookies, which is very difficult in a very high panic area. Yeah, the only, we've got two squaddies. Both of them are heavy, oh, three, support and two heavies. Let's see what we can salvage from this ridiculous situation, shall we? Give heavies the scopes. We don't have any better armor. We don't have any better weapons. So this is what we're going in with, basically. Ugh. 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 So bad. Ugh. Can't wait for our sniper to get back. But going with a bunch of rookies in for a terror site. Hopefully, they don't all die like they did last time. But I am not confident in our chances. Touching down. The drop site for this operation will be in Canada. Oh, Canada. Our home and native land. I'm not from Canada, just FYI. Oh, this is going to be no good. No good at all. We are in for some pain. Mega, mega pain. Because now, as we mentioned, saw in the last episode, we get introduced to a new type of enemy. Chrysalids, which make zombies. Oh. So this new type of mission we haven't seen yet. It's a terror site. As you can see, there are humans around. There's remaining humans, uh, evacuated humans, and dead humans. So we have to try and save as many humans as possible while taking out all of the aliens. So what we're we going to do? Have a quick look around, see if I can find a human to show you. You can hear all the sounds of death and destruction in the background. You can't see any. Oh, there's a human there. You can see him on the roof. Oh, there's some more inside. One over there. It's all bad. It's a bad, bad time. All right. Okay. So we got some floaters. That's not so bad. Chrysalids are worse. Forty percent chance. Let's see if we can do some sort of trap. Ooh, you can already see an enemy. Oh, let's get to some cover. I doubt I'll be able to see any from over here, but it'd be a good flanking position. Yeah. All right. Let's see if we can get everyone into cover and ready to start shooting some aliens. Um, let's go over to here. I'm just getting nice flanking positions. Since we got a bunch of freaking rookies. Alright. Everyone's in Overwatch, so we're going to form what's called an Overwatch Trap. Let's get out of here. 
Now they have to come to us. Although they'll likely just shoot humans. Oh no, they're coming to us. Here we go. Bop, 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 bop. Missed. Okay. Not a good start. Oh dear. Really? One of our rookies was just killed just right off the bat. And a human was just killed. Oh dear. Okay, so that was possibly one of the worst starts we could have asked for. Don't know why it's centered on him, but okay. Alright, let's get this over with. Let's get up in there. Let's save the heavy to last. We might be able to use a rocket to take them out. Aha, we are flanking one of them. 60% chance to hit. Alright, take that alien out. Or don't, either way. Ugh. Ugh. Crikey. Again, let's take a shot at the... That one. Come on. Boom. Okay. Okay, we can, we can dig it. Alright, let's... If I blow up... It doesn't actually get the... Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah, why not? Let's do it. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Alright, we've got our one heavy left. Okay. Alrighty. And he's okay. Oh my. This specimen is nothing like the others. Seems like they've got one of everything. We may have to sacrifice some humans here to take out. Nope. Not an option. And another human was killed. Right, uh bad, 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 badness. These things are bad, bad, baddie, bad, bad. In that order. Shoot the face. Shoot it in the face. In the face. Come on. Okay. Excellent. Now we know there's one down in there. So I may have to sacrifice these humans to try and take it out. For the greater good and all that. Oh, this is not good. There we go. Yep. Cool. I did what was needed. What was needed for the greater good. But I do need to get up there to see if the chrysalid is still alive. It's not really a safe place to go, so I'll just move forward a bit. Yep, there we go. Uh, we might be able to take it out. Maybe we'll grenade. Will we'll grenade reach that far? Of course it won't. Come on, come on, come on, rookie. No. Nah. Don't kill any humans. It jumped. Oh. I think it just murderized a human. This is not good. If it jumped up onto the roof and killed a human, which means there's going to be zombies around. We dislike zombies. A lot. Um, there's a spot there where I can rescue a few humans. That provides no cover though because the floaters are in the way. Uh, okay, let's go. Hmm. Maybe I can get around oh there's three humans there yeah but let's rush forward because I believe dangerously one civilian saved where can you see it, bad guys over there all right let's see if you can get closer yeah boy 
It actually lowered my chance to hit. That's irritating. Yes, those are all words that I do not understand. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Boom. Ah, add a promotion as well. Right, now we can finally start getting up into position. Wait, where is it? Oh dear, I'm in no cover whatsoever. This is not ideal. Okay, I won't get to shoot, but I'm moving into cover. Oh dear, that was someone who just got up as a zombie. Zombies take a lot of damage and hit very hard. And they're not as slow as you hope they are. Oh dear. Oh no. Ugh. That other rookie died. And that guy panicked. <laughs> Okay, uh, we need to kill that chrysalid. Die, chrysalid. Yes, you're out of ammo. This I'm aware of. You're also out of ammo. It means the floater has to come to us. As unprofessional as it sounds, the bite seems to have turned him into a... Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. No, go away. Okay, we have to kill that floater. Didn't I reload your weapon last turn? Oh, okay. Maybe that was just a mistake. 80% chance. Maybe move up to there. Shoot that thing. Four damage with a critical. Oh, okay, I really don't want to stand next to that zombie, but kill the zombie. Yay, another promotion. Right. Going to Overwatch. You need to keep an eye out for that floater. You could do that from there, I suppose. Come on, Floater. Come to your doom. That's right. Yes! What I like to see. We still lost a few guys. Ugh, lost two guys. Still saved many civilians. Yes. There was only two chrysalids, so that could have been much worse. I'm happy that we survived. I thought it would go much, much worse. I'm just going to put a little barrier up. No Ooh, everyone died. Alright, what do we got? Okay, we can either get additional use of our smoke grenade, which we never use, or extra med kits. Let's go with the extra med kits. And both of our heavies. So we already went with Bullet Swarm, so she's going to be shooting things a lot with her gun. So we're going to get Shredder Rocket, which is another rocket, but it does less damage, but means they, the enemies you hit take more damage. Enemies we shoot at haven't really been needing that, so we can get Suppression, which means people have an aim penalty when shooting at us, which is probably a good idea because we're getting shot at and killed a lot. Whereas this guy... We'll take hollow targeting with him, so we have a hollow target in the back. Since our last one died. And we've got the Defender's Medal. Chris Lead Autopsy, and just a few. Ah, yay, panic decrease in America. Let's have a look at our panic level now. Yeah, I'm sure they would. So Nigeria is still in the orange, we've got a couple in the yellow, so actually panic's not going too terribly at the moment. Not so bad. Not so bad. So we need to build an arc thrower and we need to build the alien containment facility. Our worst suspicions may have been true after all. They're not just here for abductions. Alright. We don't have any money. We have to wait till next month before we can start 
uh, building a containment lab. Irritating. Irritating. Maybe I should do that, although I don't have the money to build a mech. Yeah, okay. There's nothing much we can do here, we just have to keep going. And hopefully it's a quiet week. Yeah, I want two nanofiber vests and they'll give us engineers. That's a pretty good... Pretty good trade, but I don't think we can afford it. We can afford one vest. Alright. All right, let's see if I can buy, uh, sell something in the grey market to give us an extra 15 credits. Uh, not so much. Not so much at all. I'll sell a few floater corpses. And I'll buy two nanofiber vests. Basically just give you bonus three hit points I think at the expense of your um, your grenade slot like the scope does so I don't generally use them maybe I should have been using them uh, pinning requests extra engineers is nice now we have exactly zero money so they can't like at least we can't have money stolen from us that's something yes our corporal has returned to active duty. Now Nigeria had the worst panic, so let's keep an eye out for Nigeria. We have multiple reports of new abductions in progress. The locations are marked on the hologlobe. Alright. Let's go to the situation room. Nigeria. Is, so we need Egypt, South Africa, or Nigeria. Egypt, South Africa, or Nigeria. Of which we have none of those. Great. Okay. <laughs> Another assault. That'd be hilarious. Uh, this is not a good situation because whichever of these we ignore will go into red panic. That'll give us an assault. That'll give us scientists. This is not so difficult but gives us money. Money would be very, very, very handy right now. Because we're on zero dollars. Whereas an extra sergeant would be nice. I really don't think we can give it a go. Oh, we might have to. We might have to. We've got our sniper back. So we've got a reasonable squad. We've only got a, like three spare soldiers as well. Not ideal. Plus five defense when in cover. You've really got that metal, don't you? No, you don't. There you go, have a metal. My super sniper. Okay. Alright, let's let's go for the assault. The money would be really, really good, but having a a teammate who's not terrible would be better. Right, we are going to take... Okay, you've got aim of 73 without a scope. You've got aim of 71. So you've got the higher one, so you... Miss out on the scope. You've got aim of 81. Maybe actually we will keep it on the heavy. Normally I give scopes to snipers. But let's try and up our aim across the board instead of being generalized okay okay let's see how we go try to do this mission really quick since we're already pressing for time right now so I'm just gonna not talk about it a lot just gonna go through and do all of my options and hopefully it goes quickly should only be seven or eight aliens Brazilian authorities have requested our help 
This map is a bad place. There's very, very little cover until you get into the building. And when you get to the building, there are aliens everywhere. Alright, I'm gonna be very, very risky. Okay, no alien scene, that's good. Let's get up and into position. Alright, there's Meld over there on the right, so we're also going to run over to there. Let's get this done. There's our sniper. Go over to there. And our rookie. Let's not go too far forward in case we aggro aliens when everyone's already moved. Alright. Here we go. Alright. Let's see. Ooh, gee, oh dear. Let's um go to this heavy. See if we can blow up some aliens without blowing up that meld. Not so much bother. Let's see if this guy can, even though you're out of cover right now. Ah, oh, the front door's closed. So it'll open the front door, but... Hmm. Bollocks. Or we might have to do this anyway, why not? Let's say knock knock. And you've earned a promotion. Nicely done, Ruiz. Alright. Now you can see in there. Now that the front door has been opened. Come on, come on, come on. Um I think that's safe. Boom, another promotion. Okay. Aliens have been pacified. Let's send the rookie in there to go get the meld so we don't have our big guy going in there. Alright. That was that was a good start. Let's quickly get this done. Now our sniper can move up to here. Because you can move and overwatch with a sniper rifle. There we go. Boom. Hoorah indeed. Oh, and some floaters. Come on, not floaters, seekers. Boom! Okay, one's going into stealth mode. Which means we need to keep an eye out for things coming to kill us. You can generally see on the ground if there's a spot where you can't move to. That's where they are, like possibly right there, or that it could be because of the fire. Can't see anything, so we're going to Overwatch. Let's cover each other's backs. Doesn't look like they're anywhere there. Doesn't look like they're anywhere there. Okay, we're looking alright. Let's get the rookie to go. Grab this meld. Oh dear. I was hoping the seekers and that would be the last of the Ooh. The alien got killed and didn't die. That was interesting. Bit of a glitch. Um, since you're in the middle of nowhere there, buddy, you might need to move back a bit into cover. Our sniper. 
move somewhere where there's cover. Alright, let's kill these things. Do it quick. Nothing? Alright, that's terrifying, but okay. Oh dear. Oh, it missed me. That's alright. But now they have exposed themselves. Come on, take this sucker out. Right, we know there's three more over there somewhere. We also know there's a seeker around somewhere. Oh, there's two more over there. Sorry, not three. Let's go to that very small bit of cover right there. So hopefully he can see something from there. Nope. Take a risk with our sniper. Oh dear, not a good idea. Ow, four damage, I don't like that. Oh dear, don't die, don't die, don't die. One hit point, okay, you are not staying there, you are getting pulled out. Oh no, oh no. No, 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 no. Critically wounded, that's okay. If we kill these aliens in time, you'll be fine. Oh dear. Not good. Not good at all. Um, possibly the worst thing that could have happened. Possibly the worst thing that could have happened. Oh dear. Okay, yeah, uh, yep. Yeah. Take these aliens out. And where is that alien? Over there. I need to free that other guy as well, but I've got another heavy for that. Okay. Go to here. Open the door. Shoot that guy in the face. Alright, not so bad. We just need to stop this alien from hugging my friend's face. Boom. And hopefully that should be it. Yes! Achievement unlocked. Wet work. You guys can't see that though. Alright, this has been a slightly longer episode than usual, so once we get back to base, I'm just going to end it. Uh, yeah, that was a couple of exciting missions. We had some losses, but we did alright in the end. Got many, many promotions again. Uh, this is our healer, so revive or suppression. Let's go to revive. Make him a super healer. Let's go with what's this one? This is our heavy with suppression. Uh, confers a second reaction shot if you're not overwatching the first one's a hit or extra damage to robotic enemies. Yeah, let's go with. We'll go on Overwatch a fair bit. He can have the shredder rocket. I've decided. And this sniper can have extra damage with pistols, I think not, since you never use your pistol. Damn good ground, extra aim and defense when at a, um, enemies against lower elevation, which is good with the eye implant we got. But you're wounded again for 15 days, unsurprisingly. And we got some medals and stuff. Alright guys, um, I'm going to leave it there. We got our assault, but we'll have a look at that next episode. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching the nerd stream of... Uh, my XCOM Brave New World, and uh, yeah, see you next time. Bye.